time that people do not want to hear truth. They cannot stand truth. Truth is an offense. Truth is condemning them. Truth is breaking them up. Truth is chattering them. Truth is having them feeling guilty. Amen, somebody. Amen, somebody. Yes, truth hurts, and we got to admit that. Amen, somebody. But what we take and do with truth, amen, somebody, is the most important part of our lives. Amen, somebody. Amen. But what is killing our lives is the lies that we choose to believe in day after day after day. Amen, somebody. That is killing us, that is killing our churches, that is killing our Christian life, that is killing our spiritual walk because we choose to believe in lies. Jesus said, Behold, light has come into the world, and man who had a darkness more than light, for their deeds are evil. And we are afraid to look at our deeds. Amen? Amen. 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 And so we are ministering on the, the basic, the foundation of the, the gospel of Jesus Christ, which many believers do not have. And, and Jesus made it clear. Amen, somebody. When he met the woman at the well. Amen, somebody. Amen. And the woman was well versed in the scripture. She knew of, she knew of Abraham. She knew of Jacob. Amen, somebody. She knew. Amen, somebody. That, that it was prophesied that the Messiah of Christ will come and that he shall appear. Amen, somebody. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Amen. 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 And she understood the laws of the Jews that Jesus was not supposed to ask her for water to drink. She understood the law and the commandments and the scriptures. Amen, somebody. But Jesus told her, he said that they worship and they know not what they worship. Now, Jesus was not talking to the woman at the well, the Samaritan woman. Amen, somebody. He was speaking about his own people. Amen. That what they were worshipping, they did not know what they worship. And the reason why many Christian lives are failing today is that oh, the God that we claim to worship, we do not know who we really worshiping. Amen. 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 Amen somebody. Amen, Amen somebody. Amen. Amen. And you got to understand that. Amen. The gospel is made up of mainly two parts. There is the man Christ Jesus. Amen, somebody. And the man Christ Jesus is the greatest prophet that ever lived. He is the greatest apostle that ever lived. He is the greatest teacher that ever lived. He was the greatest evangelist. He was the greatest physician. Amen, somebody. Amen, somebody. As the son of man, he came to seek and to save that which was lost. Amen. He is the lamb of God that taketh away the sins of the world. Amen, somebody. Amen. Amen. So that is the man Christ Jesus, the Messiah. Amen. The Son of God. Amen, somebody. That was manifested to destroy the works of the devil. Amen, somebody. But within him, amen, somebody, going beyond flesh and blood, he is also God in the flesh. Great is the mystery of God in this. God was made manifested in the flesh. Amen, somebody. Now, why do I bring up that two areas because people cannot differentiate the difference Amen. between the man Christ and God that was in Christ. Amen, Amen somebody. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. So when we understand who was the man Christ, as the Lamb of God, he has bought salvation freely. Amen. Come on, somebody. Amen. So you can be saved and have salvation, and somebody who is not saved, a sinner can have your blessing. Amen. You want more to know how is that happen, how all that happened, right? Because as God, the Creator, He set up from the beginning. Laws to govern the universe. Mm -hmm. And a sinner can be more versed in the laws of the universe that God has created Amen. than you as a believer. So they can be obtaining your blessing because you there is not taking time to understand your God. Now, they might want to know about your God, 
but they want what God has created for you. Amen. And to get what God has created for you, they will follow the laws that God has ordained. Amen. And if they are following the laws that God has ordained, then you can receive what God has created for you. Amen. Jesus told them, he said, do not think that because you are Abraham's children, according to the flesh, that everything will be just given to you. Amen. And he said, if you were Abraham's children, Abraham would have heard me, Moses would have heard me, but you do not hear me, but rather you call me a devil. Amen. Amen, somebody. Amen. Amen. So the scripture is saying that we are Abraham's seed by the obedience of faith. Amen. We are blessed with Abraham by the obedience of faith. And when we read Colossians chapter, amen, sorry, Galatians chapter 3, he, he begins to show us grace, amen. law, obedience, faith. Amen, somebody. Amen. 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 It, and it starts with the foundation of the blood of Jesus Christ. Amen, somebody. Amen. So first we need to understand the law of the blood. So what are we studying? The law of the blood of Jesus Christ. Amen, somebody. What are we studying? The law of the blood of Jesus Christ. As John the Baptist saw him, he said, Behold the Lamb of God that taketh away the sins of the world. Jesus met a man, amen, somebody, that was crippled from birth, amen, somebody, amen, and then brought him to be healed, amen, somebody. And, and all the sky and the thousands was watching to see what he have, what, would have done on the Bible. day. was the Sabbath day, and it was unlawful for him to heal on the Sabbath day. Also, there was looking for an occasion where they can find something in his doctrine to condemn him maybe in somebody and he asked them which is easier for me to say thy sins be forgiven thee oh I see unto thee arise pick up thy bed and walk amen somebody as the lamb of God on the earth Jesus the Christ the Messiah had the power to forgive sins and that power is still working today and he said thy sins be forgiven thee I see unto thee arise take up thy bed and walk amen amen, amen somebody amen. 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 amen amen so we understand at the basis that the power of the blood of Jesus amen somebody amen, amen is the only power that can forgive sins amen, amen. No man in a boot can take away your sins. Amen. Amen, somebody. Amen. 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 You go in a Catholic church, you go and sit down in a boot, that's no way in the scripture. And you say, Father, I have sinned. Who's your father? Come on, somebody. Jesus said, call no one father but one. Amen. Amen. Because in his days, there were people that they considered to be elders, you will call them father. father. Amen. But, but one, God is your father. Amen. And only God can take away Sin. sins. Amen, somebody. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. So, name some of the laws you have established. While you have been here so far, in the blood, if you go back in your notes, I'm going to give you some time, go back in your notes. And um, with the notes, you should have scriptures with them. So you can call out the, the scripture where we establish. Because we don't want to hear man words. Amen, somebody. Amen. Because a man words is called philosophy and theology. Amen. And we are not saved by philosophy and we are not saved by theology. We are saved by the gospel of Jesus Christ. We are saved by the holy scriptures and the holy commandments. And we need to know them and we need to study them. Jesus said, search the scriptures and then you shall find eternal life. So we got to search them. Amen, somebody. Amen. You all went back in your notes? Amen, somebody. Amen. Give me a law of the blood of Jesus Christ. Anybody, quickly. The blood of Jesus 
has justified us. Amen, somebody. Amen. Give me a book, chapter, and verse. Where does the scripture say that? Romans chapter 5, verse 9. Read it out. This is a refreshing because we, well, two Fridays we will not hear. Amen. Praise yes. Go ahead. Much more, much more than being now being justified by the blood, we shall be saved from wrath through him. So we are justified and not just justified but saved from the wrath of God. Come on, somebody. Now we have many people that preach that God is a loving God. Amen, somebody. God is only a loving God, but the Bible tells us that we are only through the blood of Jesus we are saved from the wrath to come. Amen. And who is bringing the wrath? God is bringing the wrath. So the Bible says that he's a God of love and he's a God of? He's a God of? And he's a God of? Amen, somebody. So God has character. Amen, somebody. Amen. What is correct is a moral code that God stands by. Amen, Amen somebody. Amen. Some people say that God has a personality. Personality is a humane word relating to man. Amen. Come on, somebody. Amen. 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 You will never find the word person in the Bible relating to God. Amen. Come on, somebody. Amen. Come on, somebody. Amen, Amen somebody. Amen. 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 Who is God? The Bible says God is it. Spirit. Spirit. And they that must worship Him must worship Him in spirit. But the Bible says we must put on the divine nature, nature of God. Peter. Amen. Amen, somebody. Amen, Amen somebody. Amen. So God is a God of love, and He's a God of. Right. Right. And so the Bible said through the blood of Jesus we are what? Justified. And so just like we have never sinned. So if you are justified like you have never, amen somebody, as you have never sinned, amen somebody. Therefore, amen somebody, there is no penalty for sin in your life. Amen somebody. The sins you have committed, the sins your fathers have committed, there is no more penalty for sin. Amen, somebody. Amen. Amen, somebody. But if after you have come to the knowledge of Christ and you continue to live in the sin where Christ has delivered you from, come on, somebody. Amen. The Bible says that there remaineth no more sacrifice for what? Willing sins. Willing sins. Amen, somebody. No, but that's not means you are not saved. People, people misunderstand the word again. Amen, somebody. Amen, Amen somebody. Amen. 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 The Bible says the soul that sinned, the word sin it means to continuously Continu live, live in sin. Amen. To do what? Continuously live in sin. Sin it means to be continuously Amen. in it. The soul that sinned shall surely die. Amen, somebody. Amen. 